Hello beauties, welcome back to my channel. Happy New Year guys and today we have another best of skincare series. We are continuing with what I left off last year and today we are going to be talking about facial oils. I hope that this year, the I'm talking about 2022, will be a lot more kinder to all of us because we know, um, you know, last two years was really hard for a lot of us uh, mentally physically and i just hope that this year it will bring you all the success happiness and most importantly good health for you and your loved ones i hope you also watched my previous videos when i started the best of series uh, skincare i didn't want to make one lengthy video best of skincare because I realized, hey, our skin type is different. Our budgets are different. So this way, if I could categorize uh, under different sectors, like best of cleansing balm, best of face wash, which is done, best of Indian medical store, which is also done, best of serums and now face oils, and next will be moisturizer, sunscreens, best hair, best body. I'm hoping to complete that by the 10th of Jan. So I'm being very ambitious out here. But this way you can choose a product that is great for your skin type as well as that is not going to hurt your pocket. So without wasting much time, let's start because I have some beautiful facial oils that made me forget all international facial oils. And I've got codes for you guys. And that is only because the reason I attach codes on the screen, again, I'm mentioning it is to cut the confusion because when I don't do that, I get asked a lot of questions because not many people check the info bar. So I get asked a lot of questions. Do you have a code for this brand, that brand? And this way, this just avoids all the confusion but shop wisely and I'm also again telling you use the discount code of your favorite content creator no one's forcing you to use mine I'm just using it to cut the confusion so now that we've got all that out of the way let's just start the first one that has come to the list is from Born skincare uh, I know in last year best of 2020 I did mention about their vitamin C water and I'm so glad in the year 2021, I started testing out a lot more because I wanted to see what the hype was all about. So this is the Cranberry Seed Face Oil with Vitamin F. This is such a lovely hydrating oil and cranberry seed is very beneficial for the skin. The cranberry oil in this just fights free radicals and then reduces sun damage. The star ingredient in this is the Vitamin F because it's filled with omega fatty acids. And Vitamin F strengthens the lipid barrier as well as improves your skin tone, the skin texture. Plus tamanu oil is also included in this which we all know that how highly beneficial uh, tamanu oil is it's filled with antioxidants tamanu is very good for acne prone skin because it speeds up the healing process of it and at the same time it is a very good anti-aging oil it's also got tea tree oil that is very beneficial for people who've got oily skin as well as you know that slightly acne prone skin but it's also got sweet orange oil to brighten the skin. So keep that in mind if you are a little allergic to sweet orange oil. Though I feel that this is more of that night skincare product because it's very, very hydrating. What I love about this oil, it feels luxurious. It's a fantastic oil. You can apply this in the morning as well as night. I would suggest that as soon as you open the bottle, only because of the cranberry seed oil, try to use it within three to four months because I feel that the longevity is around that duration. Um, and if you see the color changing, it's only because, you know, there's some natural ingredients that can change the color of it, but it doesn't affect the efficacy of it. So don't worry about that. But all in all, a beautiful oil and a great start to the facial oil series. Now, the second oil is an Ayurvedic facial oil, the queen of all Ayurvedic facial oil, and everybody loves this. This year, I have spoken about a lot of Kunkumadi Thailams, guys, because it is my absolute favorite oil. They are about, you know, very few brands that has formulated very well, because with a Kunkumadi, you need to buy it from a reputed brand. You need to buy something that's very well formulated. And keeping everybody's budget in mind, something that, you know, where affordability in comparison to all the Kunkumadi, this particular particular brand has made a Thailand that really stood out. And I've spoken about Kunkumadi Thailand, the 24K Kunkumadi from the Tribe Concepts for the last two years. I'm again putting it in the list because it is that good. And I know that whoever has bought this Thailand has absolutely loved it and it has suited your skin. The 24 karat Kunkumadi Thailand from the Tribe Concept is a beautiful anti-aging facial oil. This one is a complexion booster. With saffron being its base, it's also got manjista, it's also got harit 
It's also got a base oil of sesame seed oil and there is nothing more hydrating than a sesame seed oil. This one will definitely help in repairing that uneven skin tone, hyperpigmentation and extremely dull skin. You just need to apply this before you sleep as your last step in your night skincare routine and you'll start to see your skin looking a lot more radiant after a couple of weeks. But you wake up early morning with a very soft supple skin. Kukumadi is suitable for all skin types, especially for dry skin, but it is not meant for anybody that suffers from cystic acne. And I have seen that it does bring about a slight difference to your under eye area as well. The thing about starting off with the Kukumadi Thylam is you need to get used to it because sometimes sesame seed oil takes a while for your skin to mesh well with it. So just take about two, three drops, massage that on the face, you know, leave it on for about 20 minutes and then go wash off your face. Do that for about a month or so. And then when your skin gets used to it, try to use it at night as your last skincare step. This brand is all about giving you homegrown, locally sourced ingredients. And I like the fact that this is also budget friendly in comparison to all the kunkumadi that is there in the market today. It sits very well on the skin. And as the skin absorbs it, it hydrates. And at the same time, it really helps with that hyperpigmentation. I love this Kunkumadi. Now facial oils have come and gone and this particular brand's facial oil has really stood nice and strong. And I'm talking about Plum Goodness, Grape Seed and Sea Buckton Oil. I think when I first discovered my love for Indian skincare brands, I did talk about this facial oil. And over the years, I'm on my fourth bottle. I'm nearly done with it because that's how much I love. If you're looking out for a extremely hydrating oil that doesn't make your skin feel greasy, this is the oil for you. It has all the high performance oil profiles out here in this tiny little bottle. It's got sea buckton oil, it's got grapeseed oil, it's got uh, rosehip oil, it's got sunflower oil and olive oil to name a few. This one is an incredible potent antioxidant facial oil that pairs beautifully with any skincare products. You want to use this in the morning, you can. You want to use this before makeup, after makeup, as your last step in your night skincare routine there is absolutely no problem this one is loaded with essential fatty acids it's also loaded with minerals which just helps in nourishing your skin and making it nice soft and supple and at the same time you're getting all the benefits of vitamin e and a that is also infused in this this is such a beautiful oil that is incredible for people who have got i would say dry combination normal borderline oily skin this is slightly heavy when you touch it texture wise but as soon as it sits on the skin the skin easily absorbs it and not an iota of greasiness or tackiness on the skin a beautiful oil that has stood the test of time from plum goodness and definitely worth the money I think end of 2020 is when I started my facial oil series I wanted to educate all of you I wanted to talk about my passion for facial oils and I wanted to let you guys know that, you know, fearing facial oils is not the way to go. It can actually add so much of benefits to your skin. And I started off the series with my love for rosehip oil. And I spoke about the queen of all oils are, is a good organic rosehip seed oil. And over there, I spoke about this juicy chemistry organic rosehip seed oil. This is pure. This is so wonderful. And I have tried international ones. I'm talking about, I've tried from Inky List. I've tried from the Ordinary Trilogy all of them and I still feel that this definitely supersedes all of them. This has an incredible way of bringing a visible difference to your skin. First of all, it's a fabulous anti-aging oil, super beneficial for people who have got mature skin. In fact, age no bar with this facial oil. This also has the ability of boosting collagen formation. It helps with hyperpigmentation, uneven skin tone, whatever problems that your face has. Guys, this has a tendency of improving skin texture. Now, if you want more information, you need to check out the oil series. This was the first video, in fact, and I know so many of you, when I did that video, went and bought the Juicy Chemistry one and have fallen in love with it. I know for a fact that many of you have had wonderful skin transformation ever since you have used this. You need to be patient with it, like with all other facial oils, but with this one in particular, I think you will see visible difference after around four months of continuous use. You've got to make sure that, you know, it is GMO free. You have to make sure that, you know, from the soil to the bottle, you're getting the purest, high quality stuff out here. And when it comes to JC, you know that you're going to get the best of the best. I trust that brand completely. So please trust me when I tell you if there's that one facial oil you need to test waters with. For example, you have never used a facial oil. You're looking out for that right facial oil to start off with. 
an 100% organic rosehip seed oil is the way to go and especially this one from Juicy Chemistry. Now like I mentioned in the previous you know Juicy Chemistry rosehip seed oil I did tell you that when it comes to rosehip seed oil I do not like any you know added fragrance or essential oils in it. The only other thing that I like added to a rosehip seed oil is a stronger oil profile something that's extremely beneficial for your skin and hair and that ingredient is a jojoba oil and this one from Cure's Joro oil made it to the list only because guys this is a beautiful rosehip seed oil with an element of added benefits coming from jojoba. Because of jojoba it is anti-inflammatory, it is antimicrobial and antifungal. This is also another beautiful non-greasy oil that really works wonders on your pigmentation, uneven skin tone which comes from that anti-aging benefits comes from the rosehip seed oil. Again pure organic, uh, absolutely no fragrance in this, sits very well on the skin, very deeply high hydrating because ohoba adds in that you know extra hydration to the skin anyway rosehip seed oil has got that thickness texture wise but with an added ohoba it is just perfect for all skin types i feel especially for dry skin and i feel that because of that added element of ohoba oil in this uh, skin is skin you guys this is not only beneficial for your facial skin this is excellent for your scalp as well so it's very hydrating and because of that you know anti fungal, antimicrobial, as well as anti-inflammatory, any problems that you have in your scalp. I have noticed that every time I've got that itchiness or I've got that very dry, flaky scalp, this has come to the rescue. I take about three, four pumps of this and just deeply massage my scalp. If you've got a compromised skin barrier, especially after using the wrong actives, a rosehip seed oil can come to the rescue. Uh, but this one in particular, because of that anti-inflammatory property that this particular product has, it has a way of just settling down your skin in the most beautiful way. Now two products from the Earth Rhythm has made it to the list and they have really done a good job with these two facial oils. The first one I have already spoken to you so many times and that is the Bakuchiol oil. Now the benefits of a Bakuchiol I have already made a whole separate video under my oil profile series so please go check it out. Like I said these oil series videos will help you choose the right oil profile for your skin type. And over there I told you that when you are allergic to retinoids and retinols because I know so many people are allergic to that. Bakuchiol has been proven by many dermatologists, skin professionals, like how they love a good rosehip seed oil. Bakuchiol oil is also one of their favorites. It's got a lot of anti-aging benefits. They do say that it has a way of imitating a retinol. That claim, I know there are research that you know shows that that claim is true, but not enough. But I do feel on continuous use of a Bakuchiol oil, you tend to see a difference on any fine lines, any hyperpigmentation. So for aging skin, it's a fantastic oil. So the Bakuchiol oil that the Earth Rhythm has made is a wonderful start. If you are thinking of trying out, please try out that oil because it's also got blue tansy oil. Now blue tansy has got calming properties. So it basically is fabulous for people who have got irritated skin skin and I know many international skincare also adds blue tansy into that I know that Sunday Riley plays around with blue tansy and that's an oil that I really like because it also helps with acne prone skin then this particular bakuchiol also has got grapeseed oil so it really packs in that hydration but it's the bakuchiol in it that really helps in promoting that collagen and just improving your skin texture. I think they have done a very good job. I'm talking about the Earth Rhythm as a brand. Like the next one that made it to the list again from uh, the Earth Rhythm is this one called the Brazilian Nut Oil. Now this is cold pressed and I wasn't expecting too much out of this you guys. I just felt like yeah this will be another facial oil. What is it going to do? But when I started using this my god it really took me by surprise. Now because it it has got you know that deep hydrating factors in this it helps a dehydrated skin with its fine lines and aging skin basically because dehydrated skin has a tendency of aging faster so if you have got very 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 dry skin then this is the facial oil that you should reach out for use this as your last step in your night skincare routine if you've got very very dry skin you can even apply this in the morning there's no problem out here I'm talking about uh, you know there's no restrictions with this facial oil again it goes with any other skincare products it's not it's going to mesh very well your skin is not going to be disturbed 
and Brazilian oil anyway encourages skin cellular repair, which is, I mean, what's not to love about it? It's an excellent emollient, you know, just to prevent dryness. And not only is it very good for your facial skin, it is incredible for your scalp as well. Guys, I don't know if you've heard of this brand called Ozone Signature. Now, I did on Instagram watch a lot of these content creators that talk about skincare and fashion bloggers talk about this brand because so many people were talking about it. You know, there was a lot of promotion going on with the ozone facial oil. So I thought, let me give this one a shot. But this particular product, Harid Radhya Thailam, this really surprised me. Now, I feel this is the oil. I really need to, you know, research a lot more on this because it's another Ayurvedic brand, Ayurvedic formulation. The base oil of this is sesame oil. First of all, all the oils that I told you about will suit men and women. This one also in particular. But I think for anybody that has got acne scarring, uh, this really helps in improving uh, the look of that acne scars, okay? It fades away dark spots. I feel it's because of the turmeric factor also that really helps with that, you know, whatever uneven skin tone that you have and that discolorization that you have, as, as well as those brown spots that is left behind after acne. I think turmeric has that ability of just, you know, fading away dark spots. And maybe that is why your skin starts to look a lot more better. And also it's got licorice root extract, which is good for people who have got irritated skin. It's anti-inflammatory. So if you are not a serum person, like, you know, you're not a nice and a mite fan or a vitamin C fan in general, and you want something that's Ayurveda based on just improving acne scars, then just give this one a shot because I feel this is a really good product. And I don't think many are talking about this particular product or brand. I've not heard many in the YouTube space talk about it. I don't know, I could be wrong. Correct me if I am, but I feel they should because I feel that this really helps in reducing age spots. So I don't know if you've heard about this, please don't sleep on this particular product, especially if you're looking out for something that's going to improve dark spots or sunburns or acne scars, marks, then this is a really, really good facial oil. A uh, very different texture wise from a kunkumadi. I feel that this is a lot more thicker. So there is also that hydration factor. And I think you get this on Amazon, you get this on Flipkart. They've got two different sizes. They've got a 30 ml for around 1700 and they've got a 5 ml for 399 rupees so you can check it out depending on your budget and see if this suits you so i would choose the 5 ml one now another oil profile that i covered in my oil series was squalene and i've spoken time and again how much i love squalene oil this is one oil that you can use with any actives of your choice any skincare products any time of the day you want to apply it twice, three times, four times, mix it up with makeup, before makeup, after makeup, it just doesn't matter. Now squalene, just like hyaluronic acid, is naturally occurring. So what that means is that our body already has it. But obviously both of them have got different jaw profile. The hyaluronic acid is all about, you know, increasing that water, that hydration in your skin. Squalene acts like a barrier, you know, it just locks in the moisture. Now I have three beautiful squalene oils that is there, officially there in our Indian market. Usually when it comes to a squalene oil, I only rely on the ordinary and the inky list because of course when it comes to squalene, any squalene ingredients or any squalene related products from the inky list especially, they have done an outstanding job. But with the three squalene that has come out of the Indian market, I can tell you for a fact that they are so wonderful. They are suitable for all skin types, age no bar, whether you are teenager all the way to mature skin, you can enjoy it. The first one obviously is from Sugandha. And this squalene oil has to be the most lightweight, non-greasy squalene I have come across. It just, I mean, the skin drinks it up, but at the same time, it leaves such a beautiful film of hydration on your skin. And I am yet to come across something that can beat the Sugandha one. Well, of course, the other two does an uh, incredible job of providing that hydration, packing in all that benefits because that's what a squalene does. It softens the skin, it moisturizes the skin, it helps when your skin is irritated, it protects the natural skin's barrier, it kind of like plumps up the skin. The next one that made it to the list is the Squalene Skin Hydrator from Hindalji 
Giorgio Essentials again I've spoken about how wonderful the squalane is. You can derive your squalane from sugarcane or you can derive your squalane from olives. Both of the squalanes, I'm talking anything derived from olives as well as from sugarcane is non-comedogenic so don't worry that it's going to clog your pores. Like I said again it sits very lightly on the skin, non-greasy, skin absorbs it beautifully but at the same time it packs in that hydration. So if you've got dry to sensitive skin to oily skin this oil from Indulgio also will suit you. Try this one because this is derived from sugarcane as well as olive. This one penetrates deep into your pores you know like I said the skin easily absorbs it and it just works on a cellular level but this is such a beautiful squalane from Indulgio. And last but not the least that has made it to the list of the best squalane of 2021 is this beauty from The Minimalist. This is 100% again squalane olive derived. Another beauty from The Minimalist uh, a very non-fussy uh, very helpful squalane again. I would say texture wise from the lightest to the heaviest. I'm talking about how it feels on the skin where you know texture is concerned hydration is concerned first would be suganda where lightweight is second would be the indulgio and third would be the minimalist because this is a little more thicker so if you've got very dehydrated skin posh skin then this is the squalane for you because i feel that texture like i mentioned it's a little more thicker okay just a point percent but again it does all the wonderful benefits what a squalane should do i mean there's nothing that is different that this oil would do from the other two oils because this is density wise a little thicker I would say go slowly with the squalane let your skin get used to it because I've heard people breaking out with this one from the minimalist but once your skin gets used to it it provides that same nourishment if you're looking out for a very good facial oil that goes very well with the retinol without any disturbance retinoid retinol whatever squalane is the one for you and I think that is why they have formulated a slightly thicker squalane that goes very well with their retinoids that's it my beauties these are the best facial oils that made it to the 2021 list and I hope to see you tomorrow in the best of body care and after that we're going to finish it off with moisturizers and sunscreen and hopefully if you want hair care products because I've spoken a lot about hair care let me know if you want me to do the best hair products I shall do that for you and we shall just put this series to an end I'll see you when I see you and until later bye for now